We're hopeful that this will be different, that we won't do the uh, traditional model where they do something and we give them a bunch of money and then uh, both sides walk away. Our ask is complete and total denuclearization. What we need to see from Kim Jong-un is that he and the entire North Korean regime have made a strategic decision that they will be better off without weapons of mass destruction. We can create conditions for real economic prosperity for the North Korean people that will rival that of the South. And that is our expectation. It won't be U.S. taxpayers. That for sounds their like sanctions too. relief. To make no. it possible for a company to invest directly in North Korea. Ma'am, ma ma if, if we get denuclearization, of course, there'll be sanctions relief. Uh, 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 certainly. Uh, there'll be more than that. Is it just sanctions relief? Might there be uh, an embassy in Pyongyang? Might there be economic aid? Well, I wouldn't look for economic aid from us. I think what uh, the prospect of, uh, for North Korea is to become a normal nation, uh, to behave and interact with the rest of the world uh, the way South Korea does. Is there an appetite in Congress to provide that kind of investment or sanctions relief? Be the best money we ever spent. If you could, ever, if you could really get North Korea to give up their nuclear program, then I think there'd be a lot of support in Congress to give North Korea a better life. Does the president intend to push Kim on human rights during this summit? Well, I think he's certainly going to raise the question uh, uh, of the Japanese abductees. Uh, South Koreans are very concerned about South Korean citizens who have been kidnapped over the years. Uh, and uh, it's a proper subject to raise. As part of that, are we in effect saying to Kim, if you give us what we want, you can stay on in power? We will have to provide security assurances to, to be sure. What will this summit in Singapore look like? Are you walking into the room with President Trump to sit across from Kim Jong-un? I don't know. You don't know yet? I don't know. Uh, we're working on the details, the, the, the actual blocking and tackling of the meeting. We have been working on them for weeks. Uh, he does follow the Western press. He'll, he'll probably watch this show at some point. Uh, he's paying attention to things that the world is saying. Uh, he, too, is preparing for June 12th. He and his team will be working with them uh, to put our two leaders in a position where it's just possible we might pull off a historic undertaking. Was there any mention of the exchange of insults back and forth? No, we didn't cover that, Chris. <laughs> Probably was.